Photographers, here are five things that your website desperately needs. Number one, call to action. You want as many buttons or links as possible. This creates links across your website, which is really good for SEO. And it also means if people like your work, they can book you straight away by clicking a button easily. Number two, it needs to flow. So just like a path of breadcrumbs like Hansel and Gretel, you need your clients to naturally flow through your website. You want to see your work, meet you, and then gradually lead them to your booking form. If your stuff is all over the place and your website is really difficult or confusing to navigate, then people are just gonna click off immediately. It needs to be simple, obvious, and gets people to where they need to go, fast. Number three, an about me page. Arguably, after your portfolio, the most important page on your website, people want to meet you. You should definitely have something on your homepage. People need to see your face as soon as they click on your website as well as your work. And then a little call to action button underneath if people want to read more about you. You're selling a service and people need to get to know you. If they can't build that trust, it's unlikely they'll book you. Do you know the amount of bookings I've got just because people liked me, not necessarily my work? So if you don't have an about me page, get one now. Number four. SEO. These are things that you do on your website to make it discoverable on Google. So for example, I'm a photographer in West Sussex, so if someone types into Google, West Sussex photographer, I want to be one of the first websites that they see. Now you do this by putting keywords and things into your website, so when people search for things, it automatically comes up on Google. So for example, if I post a photo, the metadata on the photo will say West Sussex photographer, as opposed to, say, Emma and James's wedding. Make sure to be location specific as well, especially with venues. So if you've done something at say Langshot Manor, then make sure on any photos you share on your website, in the metadata, the description of the photo is Langshot Manor Wedding. So if a couple search for Langshot Manor Wedding on Google Images, guess whose photos come up? Yours. Number five, fast loading speeds. Now this helps with SEO as well, but the last thing you want is for a couple to click on your website and then click immediately off it again because nothing's loading correctly. Compress your photos, they don't have to be full res on your website. The quicker your website can be downloaded, the more it will show up on Google. And the more people will stay on your site because they won't be pulling their hair out. Do you have any tips? Let me know in the comments.